Hey guys, welcome back to our channel Technology. So today in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to access your router from outside of your network. So you just need to follow me. So first of all, as you can see, here is my router page, which I am using right now, Tipling. So log in on your router and you have to go to this website, which is no IP. So I have already uh, created one account over there. So if you want to create one account, then click on this sign up button. So I will give you the link on my video description. After that, you have to put your email ID over there and then password and you have to select your host name in my case, like uh, technology one or whatever you can choose here. Okay. Or you can uh, create your host name later if you will click over there. And after that, you have to click on this free sign up. Okay. After sign up, you have to log in with your username and um, password to uh, this website, which is uh, no IP. So after go to this website, you have to click on this manage domains. Now you have to click on dynamic DNS and here you will get your host name and your IP address. So if you don't have created any domain uh, host name over there, then just uh, create one host name using this button. And after that, copy that host name and go to your router page and go to the system tool. And here you will get a dynamic DNS. So you have to find dynamic DNS on your router and after that you have to put your domain name over there and your password to put which you have already created and your email ID. After that click on enable DDNS and click on login. So as you can see it's showing connecting so you have to wait for a few seconds. So as you can see, showing succeed. So now what you have to do, you need to click on modify and you have to go to the google.com and after the type over there, my IP and you have to copy this IP address to your uh, no IP and after that click on update host name. So now it is done. So it is uh, targeted my new IP as you can see, here is my new IP. So now try to access with this domain name from outside of your network and it will work. So I hope this small video will really help for you and please don't forget to click on the subscribe button, like button and share button. And if you have any calls or questions then comments down below. I will see you guys on the next one next video. Take care.